Once upon a time in a cozy little house nestled at the edge of a quiet town, there lived a young child named Emma. Emma had a teddy bear named Mr. Cuddles, who had been her faithful companion since the day she was born. Mr. Cuddles was a soft, brown bear with a friendly smile and button eyes that sparkled with kindness. He was more than just a toy. He was her dearest friend. One bright and sunny morning, as Emma was getting ready for a day of play, she couldn't find Mr. Cuddles anywhere. Her room was usually filled with the comforting presence of her beloved bear, but today, it was empty. Emma's heart sank, and her eyes welled up with tears. She knew she had to find Mr. Cuddles. Determined to reunite with her cherished teddy bear, Emma set off on her quest. She started by searching her room, under her bed, in her toy chest, and even in her closet. But Mr. Cuddles was nowhere to be found. Just when Emma was about to lose hope, she heard a faint giggle coming from her dollhouse. Emma rushed over to the dollhouse, and to her astonishment, the tiny dolls that usually stood frozen inside were now alive and moving about. The dolls were a kind-hearted bunch and had seen Mr. Cuddles wandering through the house earlier that morning. They decided to help Emma on her quest to find her teddy bear. With the dolls as her guides, Emma embarked on a magical journey through her house. The adventure took them to places she had never seen before, like the secret tunnels behind the bookshelf, the hidden passages under the staircase, and the attic filled with forgotten treasures. Along the way, they encountered other stuffed animals and toys who also wanted to assist in the search. There was Timmy the tiger, who had a keen sense of smell and could sniff out clues. Rosie the rabbit was a skilled jumper and helped them reach high places. Benny the brave little soldier toy provided protection, while Lulu the ballerina toy danced gracefully to lighten the mood. Together, they formed a loyal and resourceful team. As the day turned into night, the group of toys and Emma grew tired but never gave up hope. They finally reached the darkest and dustiest corner of the attic, where they found Mr. Cuddles snuggled up next to an old, forgotten quilt. Emma's face lit up with joy as she rushed to embrace her lost teddy bear. With Mr. Cuddles safely back in her arms. Emma thanked her newfound friends for their help and promised to visit them more often. The dolls and toys returned to their usual places, once again frozen in time. From that day on, Emma appreciated her toys even more and understood that they were more than just playthings. They were companions and, sometimes, even heroes. Every night, before drifting off to sleep, she made sure to tell Mr. Cuddles and all her other toys how much she loved them, and they all felt the warmth of her love in their magical world. And so, in that little house on the edge of the quiet town, Emma and Mr. Cuddles continued to have many more adventures, both in the real world and the magical one they shared with their toy friends.